Hi, I'm Kyle Ruddy, a Senior Technical Marketing Engineer here at VMware. The automation capabilities of PowerCLI allow administrators to manage hosts by using custom scripts. Configuring each host setting requires just a few lines of PowerCLI code. While you can fully configure a host by merging a number of different scripts. This allows you to automate the host configuration process and ensure consistency between the hosts that need to be configured identically. In this video, you will see examples of adding a host to a vCenter server system, setting the host to be in maintenance mode, licensing the host, adding an NTP server, setting up the networking, and adding data stores to the host. The first step is to add a host to a vCenter server system. Having specified the instance you want to add the host to, you need to provide a name for the host, a data center or folder where you want to place the host, as well as a username and password for authentication. Some operations, such as rebooting, updating, or patching the host, require it to be in maintenance mode. If you need to perform any operations that involve restarting the host, you must change its state to maintenance. Next, you can provide a valid license key or set the host to evaluation mode by providing the standard evaluation key, as shown in this example. To set up the host to use NTP-based time synchronization, you must add an NTP server to the host configuration. To set up the networking, you need to create a virtual switch. Next, you can add a virtual machine port group to provide networking for virtual machines. Optionally, you can also enable vMotion for the host. Having configured the networking settings, you can create data stores on the host. When creating a data store, you must specify the file system. You can create both VMFS and NFS data stores. Finally, having performed the initial configuration, you can activate the host by setting it to a connected state. All these configuration steps can be merged into a single script that allows you to automate the entire host configuration process. Such a script can be used as a template where the values can be modified to the specifics of each host you create and configure. As you can see, configuring one or many hosts with PowerCLI can save you time and reduce human error. For more examples of PowerCLI's scripts for host configuration, see the PowerCLI commandlet reference. To learn more about PowerCLI and other VMware products, visit pubs.vmware.com.